Sorry about the cutoff in my last video, um, especially sorry to KL Pokemon 1994. Um, my memory uh, stick ran out of space right in the middle. So I will start over again with KL Pokemon 1994's trade. Um, she sent, a, as extras, a bunch of booster pack wrappers. Um, a Rayquaza from Deoxys, Absol from Platinum, I can't remember this one. Zang? No. I should know this one from Holland Phantoms. Um, Lucario from Diamond and Pearl. Aerodactyl from Legend Maker. Arcanine from Legend Maker. Mew from Legend Maker, which is kind of cool because I think there's only one more Legend Maker pack that I need now. Um, Darkrai, maybe, from Majestic Dawn. Um, Hip Hippowdon from Majestic Dawn. Magmortar from Mysterious Treasures, Walrein from Power Keepers, Flareon from Delta Species, Salamance from Delta Species, um, Salamance and Dragonair from Dragon Frontiers, I don't remember what this one is from Mysterious Treasures, and a Murkrow from Secret Wonders. And for the cards, um, oh, and she also sent um, some money, Canadian and American, to buy some cards. And then the cards that she sent as part of the trade, a Reverse Espeon from Delta Species, rare. A Reverse Marsh Tomp from Crystal Guardians, rare. A Reverse Life Herb from Platinum. A Reverse Feraligator, rare from Mysterious Treasures. A Hollow Breloom from uh, Deoxys, I think. And a Dialga Level X non-promo from um, the Platinum set. So this one, definitely the best card of the bunch. Really, really nice. Because um, I don't have many Platinum Level X cards. I think I only have um, one, now two, if you add in my Dialga G Level X. So again, that was KL Pokemon 1994. Um, awesome trader. The next trade is from 123 Star Wars fan. And I think this is a new trader for me. Um, and he sent a note. Uh, says, thanks a lot for the binder. Here's the money. I included a little present. Hope you like it. Happy holidays. And he, um, buying one of my extra binders from me and, um, put the money in the Rayquaza Platinum Supreme Victors pack. Um, so there's the cash. And then, um, as extras, he set a Deoxys Normal Form Hollow number one from Legends Awakened, and a promo p from Pop 2 Hollow Suicune. Um, don't think I have this one yet, uh, but I'm not sure about the Deoxys. Um, so the Deoxys may be up for trade, um, but the Suicune I'm pretty sure I definitely need. So really nice extras, and um, I thank you. And the last trade is from Gengar Freak, um, also a new trader. Um, and I also don't remember if this is from a YouTube trader or a Trade Cards Online trader. And he wrote a note. Um, hey, Kapir, thanks for the awesome trade. I didn't add much extras because you have like nearly every card I do. Uh, have a great Christmas, Gengar Freak. So, that's cool. Um, I don't expect... Whoops. Um, since I don't expect extras, um, they're always nice. And if I already have them, um, they make great trade items. So, he sent a Diamond and Pearl Stormfront um, Monferno wrapper, which is really cool. I'm pretty sure I haven't seen this one yet. So, um, that in itself is a nice extra. And the cards we traded for were a rare Aerodactyl number one from Sky Ridge. Um, not sure why in those, um, when they made the set, they didn't make um, particularly hollows. They just had the reverse hollows. Um, and then the crystal cards or whatever else they added on. Um, anyways, a reverse hollow Butterfree from Expedition. A reverse hollow Executor from Aquapolis. A reverse hollow Staraptor from... Stormfront, a Reverse Hollow Mightyena from Platinum, a Rare Umbreon from uh, a 
Aquapolis. And I think this is an extra. And I believe this is an extra too, a reverse hollow beautifly from Platinum. So I I don't recognize either of these cards, so I may not have them already. Um, but again, that was Gengar Freak. Um, so recap, we have Gengar Freak, um, 1, 2, 3, Star Wars fan, and KL Pokemon 1994. So thanks for watching my TCBMs. I'm glad to be back from the holidays. I'll be catching up on a lot of trades. Um, and we'll probably be trying to get some updated trade binder videos since I've been making so many trades um, within the next few weeks before the new semester starts. Um, so keep a lookout for those, and um, thanks for watching my videos.